Hello, Jeff Darrington here, Senior Technical Market Manager at Greylog. Today, I'm going to show you this video to highlight the ability to geomap data into your dashboards. Geomapping data is useful to find out where remote users log in through VPN, for example, or cloud services that we include in our Illuminate content for Okta and Office 365 Spotlights. We can map by utilizing the MaxMind database as a GYP lookup tool, as you see here on our website and configuring that up. Or if you're even receiving raw longitude and latitude data from a particular source, we can do that as well. Let's step forward into logging some raw geo longitude and latitude data. Raw geo data is used every day for many things, tracking vehicle fleets, assets, tracking shipments, and a variety of other things. I found one great source, and that's through an API and an input in Greylog for the International Space Station tracking in real time and its orbit around Earth. So I decided to bring this into a dashboard. First, what we did was created an input for the actual source. Then we created some, a pipeline, a stream, and an index, had them all connected. And then finally, creating a rule. This rule is set up to take the longitude and latitude and enrich it into a gray log enabled schema and a field name source geo coordinates. And then finally, seeing the data in real time. As you'll see here, three passes so far, or almost three passes, going around the globe. In my widget, as you'll see here, I have included the source geo coordinates field. However, clicking on this field, I've created a number of values of 6,000. This would then return values for an extended period of time, getting your trailing results that you see in the map. This is just one more thing you can do in Greylog and utilize it for many things and in inputs and data. I hope you've enjoyed this example of geo coordinates for the International Space Station tracking. As always, happy logging with Greylog.